Hey there. Recently, somebody asked this question. Are you born a clown? <laughs> well, that's a great question. Here's some of my thoughts from the inside. Um, I believe that there are people that are naturally gifted. Um, certainly the way they grow up influences how they think and how they uh, respond to situations and whether they can bring comedy into it or comedy out of it. I, I know that's true. I think there are some people that are more gifted. Um, 1980, I think it was 86, might have been 87. I was in Denver, Colorado. I had been clowning six or seven years, and there was this new conference that had just started called Children's Pastors Conference. And about 300, 250, 300 children's pastors from around the country gathered at this conference, and I was invited to perform a clown routine. And uh, it was a very fun thing. Um, I'm not going to get into the clown routine, but I was on stage, blocking the stage, walking through it with my music um, one afternoon when, when the room was empty. Okay, people were at different sessions. And in through the back door walked this man named David Shelton. David Shelton was a YWAM trainer um, who would train troops of college students on using mime and drama and theater and all this type of stuff. And he was a professional performer, uh, an elite performer. And David stepped in the back of the room and stood there for a moment, looked at the stage as I was walking through my steps. And he paused and he walked straight up the aisle to me, stopped in front of the stage and said, hi, my name's David Shelton. And, and I stepped forward and he shook his hand. And he said this, he said, I, I just want to tell you this. Uh, some people want to perform and they work hard and they train and they do uh, a good job. Um, and then other people are born with it. And I just need to tell you, you're one of them that has that extra something special. And then he smiled and he walked away. <laughs> Oh my, oh my, what that did for me. Um, and I also realized that sometimes God gives people gifts in different areas. Um, and we need to be good stewards of those gifts, use those talents, um, and don't take them for granted. Now, that doesn't mean that I don't train and I don't work, uh, because I do. And I really believe this, every person can learn clown technique. Every person can improve by studying performance. And so if you're a performer and it doesn't feel natural, that's okay. Just keep learning the techniques. And there's times when I perform, maybe I don't feel well, um, I don't feel like doing it. I can always fall back on my technique even if I don't feel it in the moment. And so that's why it's important to train and improve. Um, so that we're ready for our audiences, whether we feel like it or not. Um, some people have an extra special gifting. Doesn't mean they don't need to train. Uh, but there is, but you can recognize it when you when you see that person. Uh, just keep improving, doing your best, so you can give your best to your audiences. <laughs>